my bad Pisces about all the distractions. Like, I don't know what's going on with your reading. It's like somebody knows them, they don't want me to focus on whatever this is that they're doing because somebody here is trying to be sleep. Okay, but yeah, we got the two of swords in the dance. So some of you could be ignoring a Scorpio, um, tuning them out or something, or you just don't give a fuck. It's just like you don't care anymore, two of swords. Um, yeah, I feel like this is somebody here is being very weird. It's like they have emotions for you, but it's like they're used to you letting them abuse you. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like, and now that you're like setting some type of boundaries or you're deciding to be single, it's like this person is upset because they can't like mistreat you anymore basically I also ate the cups here in the reverse yeah five of swords I told you this is somebody who's like competing with you trying to win at all costs five of swords they like to play mind games it's just like somebody out here like gets a kick out of like fucking with you, Pisces. Like, oh, that's a fire of swords here. Yeah, the hermit. Yeah, I feel like they're sitting here watching you. They could be at home alone watching you or they're doing this at night time could be a virgo with a hermit yeah the the uh world card reverse so yeah this person may feel like you guys have some unfinished business or the cycle isn't closed out between y'all like somebody here is weird as a world reverse. Yeah, Ten of Swords here. In the shadow. Uh, why is the Ten of Swords here? Yeah, I'm I feel like this is somebody who betrayed you. They did you dirty before with the Ten of Swords here. Could it even been some type of like domestic abuse or something? With the three of pentacles, this mad this person's mad because you're working with somebody else or you have a platform, you're building something and it doesn't include they ass. Like three of pentacles here. Like yeah, you could have started a new job or something for some of you Pisces, but if it's not a new job, it's like you're just working with somebody else. Three of pentacles here and they're pissed. It's like, this person don't want you to have help, don't want you to do shit. Yeah, you could be working with the emperor. Three of pentacles with the emperor. But like I said, this could be somebody in a position of power who then offers you a job or wants to work with you to help you do something here. Or this could even be a father figure. Helping you do something. And somebody here is pissed. The devil reversed. I told you, you cut this person off. The devil is no longer attached to you, Pisces. The devil is in reverse. So this Capricorn, this Capricorn, this Virgo, this Gemini, whoever the fuck this is, we got a problem because you're moving on after they tried to use you. Yeah, two of us reverse. Yeah, you realize that this person wasn't a good match. They weren't a good friend. Nothing like. Yeah, you and this person weren't equally yoked. That's the two of cups here. Yeah, the sun card. Yeah, I feel like this is somebody who's very conceited. Could be a Leo. Somebody who's very conceit, conceited, very much in their ego. Somebody who likes to brag and show off. 
So it's like they're faking their happiness. This is somebody who's really like real life depressed. Like why is the um sun reverse? Yeah, the Empress. There you are. Period. Yeah, so somebody's mad because you're in union with somebody. Some of you could be married with the Emperor and the Empress here. You and your husband or you and your spouse could have a business together with the three of pentacles here. It's like somebody's mad, like. Yeah, six of what is that? Six of Wands reverse, and this is the tower reverse, yeah. So you Pisces, you dodged, you dodge some sort of bullet. This person. I seen the two of wands too. So yeah, you chose another path. Yeah, look at that hierophant on the bottom of the deck. And you're showing up as the high priestess. It's like, hell yeah. It's like you could be in a twin flame union with the hierophant and the high priestess, the emperor to the empress. Somebody out here is in a twin flame union. And there's a karmic feminine out here pissed because her nigga is obsessed with you. Or you could be this karmic ass bitch in a relationship with somebody who's obsessed with an empress. You, you know your role, okay? You take it as it resonates. But this is Pisces reading, so I'm reading it from your perspective. And since the high priestess came out in the upright, I'm, a, I'm assuming that you Pisces. But let's see. But you're definitely a twin flame union here with the high priestess and the hierophant. So some of you definitely could be married. You could be married in the spirit to this person if you haven't actually got married to them yet. It's how reverse. And this person from your past is so mad that they can't abuse you, mistreat you, manipulate you anymore. <laughs> yeah, and I feel like this person chose the wrong path. They're not on their path at all anymore. They listen to other people, tell them what to do with their life family friends and all this type of shit this person doesn't have a car it's like their priorities are fucked up they can't get their shit together it's like they can't get their shit together without the help of the help of other people or without having to be in a relationship with somebody yeah they missed the opportunity with you ace of pentacles in the reverse and they're worried about money nine of wands and ace of pentacles reverse they could have lost a job or got let go of or fired or something. Yeah. Eight of Swords reverse. Yeah, you broke free. Seven of Wands. You blocked this person or set some type of firm boundaries. It's like this person tried to victimize you or they did something where it, where, it, where you could have been a victim of this person. I don't know what they did. I just heard a horn outside. It's like this person, it's like they resent you for leaving them out in the cold or leaving them behind. Yeah, but at the same time, strength reverse, they're a coward. There's somebody who's too weak, strength reverse. And I feel like right now they could really feel vulnerable. They could be lashing out. Um, it's like they're blaming everybody around them. But at the same time, it's just like... Like, people will only do what you allow. So, yeah, you can get mad at somebody for using you because that's fucked up. You shouldn't be using nobody. But then at the same time, are you going to be more mad at that person or be more mad at yourself because you the one who allowed them to do it? Like, you were never obligated to do anything for nobody. So, the fact that you did it anyway and went against your better judgment... You should be more mad at yourself for lacking boundaries than you mad at that person for trying to use you. That's what they do. They're a user. You know what I'm saying? But can't nobody use you unless you allow that, you know? Unless you allow yourself to be used, you know what I'm saying? It's just like you got to take, you got to protect your energy better or protect yourself. Yeah, four of wands reverse. Yeah, this person could be getting kicked out of somewhere four of wands where they live they're getting into it or they're being emasculated with whoever this is that they live that they live with because they could be living with or staying with a karmic and the bitch is treating them or she's finding out that they're like 
not that nigga. <laughs> so, yeah, three of wands, yeah. And I still feel like you, I feel like you know what's going on, high priestess, with the three of wands with this person, but you're still moving forward. Three of wands is making plans for the future. Some of you could even be at a distance from this person or you moved with the three of wands here. Yeah, Ace of Cups. Yeah, there's new love for you when you make this move. Three of Wands and Ace of Cups. There's a new cup out here for you, Pisces. Because you know this person ain't it. That real shit. Yeah, Queen of Wands. And you're gonna you're taking your power back and you're regaining control. Like real shit. And then I feel like you looking good while you're doing it too. Queen of Wands and the High Priestess. It's like the further away you get from this person, the more your confidence increases. Which is good. It's like, I feel like Pisces intuitively, you know, you made the right decision to be single or to leave this person. I mean, I don't feel like you were that happy about it, but shit, I feel like you got something else coming in with the Ace of Wands. Here. I mean, the Ace of Cups here. This is a new couple of at a distance. Three of Wands and the Ace of Cups. It's like when you move away from whoever the fuck this is, that's when the real Ace of Cups is going to come in. You're going to be in a twin flame with a High Priestess and a Hierophant. I mean, it'll be better than anything you could ever even imagine. Like, real shit. Somebody who's ready for love, ready for commitment. They're not scared for nothing. Very mature. Yeah, Temperance. I feel like for right now, though, you're on some high vibe shit. The temperance and the high priestess, I mean, the temperance and the queen of wands. Some of you um, can have Sagittarius in your chart. You know, I feel like you just on some high vibe shit right now. Queen of wands and the temperance. I feel like you chilling. You found your inner peace. You found your inner calm. It's like you're not worried about this person. It's just like you wish that, yeah, I feel like you blocked this person. Eight of wands or somebody blocked them. Yeah, I feel like something they could have got into a relationship. Very narcissistic with the with the King of Swords reverse that came out. Very narcissistic. So this could be a Libra, Scorpio, Cusper. This could be a Scorpio. This could be a Libra. It's Leo energy out here. Um, we got Virgo and Gemini energy out here as well. But the Eight of Wands reverse, I feel like this person jumped into another situation after y'all broke up, and I feel like it's backfiring. <laughs> It's like they're being met with delays or something here is slowing down or they got into a relationship really quickly with somebody and now they're over there finding out that him and whoever this is that they're living with, it's like they're over there finding out that they don't really like each other like that. That's what the Eight of Wands is. The Eight of Wands in the upright is fast-paced pace, fast pace movement. When you meet somebody in the Eight of Wands energy, of course, it takes off quick. A lot of passion, a lot of chemistry with the Eight of Wands because it's wand energy, very sexual. But it's like, shit, after that initial, like, infatuation, it's just kind of like, damn, like, I don't really like this motherfucker like I thought I did. It's like the flame is dying out. <laughs> Oh, shit. Why well, is the Eight of Wands reverse? And again, tra issues with transportation with the Cherry reverse, Eight of Wands reverse. They could be getting kicked out of somebody's house, getting kicked out of somebody's car. Like, somebody may be like, yeah, nigga, get the fuck out of my shit, leaving ass on the side of the road somewhere. Yeah, King of Cups reverse. Because somebody here is manipulative. They're a gaslighter and they're sneaky as fuck with the King of Cups reverse. Very codependent, needy. Like, they're worrisome and annoying. And a crybaby, they whine. Like, who the fuck is this? Very predictable with the page of wands reverse. So, for some of you Pisces with this high priestess energy, like, you knew this person would do this. It's like, I already know that they're going to try to get into another relationship after we break up. It's like, they don't realize that they're the problem. <laughs> King of Cups. Somebody here could be a drinker. Or alcoholic why is it King Cups reverse? They're codependent on something. Yeah, Knight of Swords. This person has a criminal history too, a criminal background, a criminal mind. This is somebody who talks really fast. They could be a finesser. This is somebody who pillow talks, gossip, run their mouth to the next motherfucker when they get into a relationship with somebody new. 
It's like they're 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 a, this person is emotionally unavailable with the King of Cups reverse. They're immature as fuck. They're needy. They're codependent. They're emotionally unstable. It's like they're not even in a space. They shouldn't be this. Whoever this is should not be in a relationship. They are not in a space with themselves where their heart is open, where they're ready to love. It's like they got issues and problems. Some of it could be mental health issues with the Knight of Swords reverse. This could even be somebody who used to be in the military or they could be still in that shit. But Knight of Swords reverse is a criminal mind, criminal activity. It's like somebody here isn't above doing like criminal shit. You know what I'm saying? But that's like an immature way of thinking. This is somebody who talks really fast. They're impulsive. They're verbally abusive. They're a liar, a manipulator. This is somebody who can't take what they dish out with the Knight of Swords reverse. It's like they do shit and say shit to other people. But if you say this shit to them, oh my God. It's like, why Why would you ever say that? You're a bitch from hell. Like, like if you don't shut the fuck up, whoever this is. Not the ones. I feel like they're really mad at you. Aggressive, irate. This is somebody who's very argumentative. Yeah, justice. Because you're receiving justice. Something new is coming in for you. A new contract. So this could be, like I said, some of you moved. This is a new house, a new car, or something here that you're getting. Or a new job. Three of Pentacles with the justice or a new relationship. Some of you, because the justice is Libra energy. It rules documentation and important paperwork and all that. Contracts and shit. So some of you with the Ace of Cups and the justice, you could be getting married. You could be somebody out here could be planning a wedding with the three of wands here in the justice. Yeah, the five of cups and somebody's like sad, heartbroken. They're in regret. Five of cups. It's like, what are they sad and heartbroken about? Yeah, the star. It's like they can't heal from whatever. There's a lot of shit they can't heal from. Like, real shit. The star. This person's very hopeless. Yeah, they can have a ruined reputation with the Six of Wands reverse and the star reverse. I mean, this is an Aquarius. Or oh, shit. Somebody could. This could be an Aquarius, Pisces, Cusper. I mean, yeah, this could be in a, a, a man, though. An Aquarius, Pisces, Cusp man. With the king of cups reverse and the star reverse yeah they're under judgment there's malicious gossip going on about this person about the decisions and the choices that they make it's like they're refusing to awaken nine of wands and then they got an attitude with everybody all right this person got a bad attitude their money fucked up they're strapped for cash they could be penny pinching It's like, but the judgment is in reverse. This means that this person is refusing to take accountability for the decisions that they make, how they live their life, what they choose to do, like listening to other people. It's like they're mad at motherfuckers for being in this position, but it's just like, who the fuck are you going to blame? Like, why are you, you know? Zero accountability. I feel like they just out here partying and kicking it, or they're seeing you do this. Queen of Cups with the Three of Cups, yeah, you could be going on a date or you could be celebrating something, Pisces. Like, real shit. Three of Cups with the Queen of Cups, you could be celebrating something here or on a date or having a good time with the Three of Cups. Yeah, and they're arguing with somebody they're in a relationship with. Yeah, I told you. Love is reversing the Four of Pentacles. They're penny pinching. It's like there's a lack of boundaries. They're arguing with this karmic that they're in a relationship with. They're arguing about money um boundaries personal space personal belongings cheating and shit like this is like what in the fuck and they mad because they can't come back around towards you yeah king of pentacles reverse told you this person is strapped for cash strapped for money you're the queen of pentacles of right this person is the king of pentacles in the reverse so this could be an ex-husband, a baby daddy. Yeah, Page of Wands reverse. I feel like this person is very predictable and they want your attention so bad. It's like they're jealous, they're acting out, they're doing childish shit. And I feel like you're choosing a new path to a wands. You've already made your decision. You're just like, yeah, I'm good. Yeah, the hangman in the upright. Yeah, I feel like you sacrificed this person. 
it's like you feel like you deserve better Pisces and you do so you're sacrificing this person even though you still care about them because you know God is going to bless you with something better something that is truly for you and he is three of wands and the ace of cups when you make this move or when you create distance between yourself and this person and really just start loving on you ace of cups three of cups enjoying your time enjoying yourself being in alignment the ace of cups is going to come in period yeah ace of swords and that's the truth because <laughs> i do feel like you're in a good space with yourself you know, your cards are coming out in the upright. The hangman, the high priestess, the queen of cups, the queen of wands, and the temperance. I feel like you're on some high vibe shit. You be chilling or whatever the case may be. You may get a little bored with being single or whatever, but you, you don't hate it. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like this person, yeah, they made a bad investment with the seven of pentacles reversed. They're frustrated. They're tired of waiting on you to say something or... Queen of Swords reverse, it's a bitter ass bitch around them. Cause I told you. King of Swords reverse came out and the Queen of Swords reverse came out in the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, she didn't lost some type of resources fucking with this person or something has happened where this Queen of Swords realized that damn, this person was a bad investment to get involved with. And I feel like they're not talking. Queen of Swords is like <laughs> I don't know. It's like they're arguing or something in this house. Yeah, and now this person's coming back towards you with this apology or they being nice all of a sudden. It's just like, yeah, they want to dead the beef with you all of a sudden. Like, nah, bro, you got into it with that bitch and now she putting your ass out. You ain't got nowhere to go. So, yeah, Pisces. Anyway, this is part two to your reading, Booski, because I don't, I don't know what was happening on their first reading. It was too many distractions. Shit was just weird. Okay, but if you made it to part two... I definitely appreciate you watching and listening to me. Um, hopefully that it resonates and you got something out of it. But yes, Pisces, this has been part two and I'm going to go. Peace.